I really think that when um, large corporations start from the beginning, which is defining very well their purpose, then it comes automatically to the strategy and what usually you call or people call CSR, it's one part of it. Uh, in our case, we are defined uh, above the CSR things, our purpose being eradicating poor vision in one generation. We want that before 2050, in one generation actually, everyone we on planet Earth will have a great life because they will see well. Uh, out of 7.3 billion people in the world, we have unfortunately still 2.5 billion people who don't see well. And around 500 million of them are in China. They either can't afford or they don't find uh, eyeglasses to help you see well. So specifically in China, we are developing our mission under two key uh, pillars. One of it, which is all our charities activities, the foundations, a Silver Vision Foundations, but also the link we are building with all the other foundations where we, through various events, we give eyeglasses to people in need. But this is never enough. The most important part of CSR activities or actions on the field to fulfill our mission in China is social impact business. This is really what will change the world. Meaning by that, identifying very young talents in remote places that we train, we empower to do, in our case, an eye exam and deliver eyeglasses. And in these social uh, impact businesses, we are, it's, it's a business, uh, uh, meaning we are selling eyeglasses uh, for basically uh, uh, 10, uh, 15 RMB, and then it is sold for 30, 40 RMB to uh, people in need. And all the chain of command is making a little money. So this is really those type of programs, social impact uh, business model, which are the most promising in China and in many countries of the world. But we need both. We need charity activities and also uh, social impact activities. I think the, the successful corporation in the next 15 years will not be based on the same economical models that we had the past uh, 15, 20 years. I think all what I learned myself in my business school 40 years ago was good for the past. Now we need to learn and to teach and to motivate uh, all the top young and future executives in China and in the world to lead with a purpose, to define with their core team uh, what should be the purpose of their corporation, to define their strategy around this purpose and to develop a model that will have impact on the world while at the same time being financially and economically very strong because both goes together. And I think CIBS should lead this initiative, should really have a specific course or programs to, to train, to form all those top executives, to think about that.